Hello guys and welcome, Millsy2000 here. I thought I'd do a quick, well not a quick video, I thought I'd do a video about the FIFA 14 demo, my opinions on it, and what I like about it and what I dislike about it. We're in the skill game now, just waiting for the game. I thought I'd just say how much I enjoy the skill games so far that I've actually played the decent. I enjoy just messing around like I just did then and yeah, it's always decent. I'm excited to go and play all the other sk skill games that they have in the uh, in the actual FIFA 14 game and maybe make a video on doing some of them or something because that can be quite fun see if you guys c can beat my scores on them or whatever so he's better at the game but what I wanted to talk about was what I like in FIFA 14 overall so overall so far I like the design of it obviously the interface and whatnot um, Ultimate Team looks awesome, the web app on Ultimate Team looks insane and the player cards just look, they look beautiful to be fair. <laughs> um, they look really good, yeah. Um, EA have done a really good job of of doing that, making the design look really good. Um, and yeah, um, it looks a lot better than it, FIFA 13, the colours are a lot nicer, it's a lot smoother and stuff. So I prefer it quite a bit, the layout and design, it's a lot faster as well through the menus which is obviously decent. The menus were a bit of a pain in FIFA when they froze and stuff, especially if you're on Ultimate Team and trying to put a crucial bid in or whatever. But I was also going to say that I like the shooting quite a lot. I like the way that you can um, kick it with the outside of your foot and whatnot, but I'm not too keen on the finesse shot that's what I was going to say, I dislike the finesse shot like I just did then they seem very OP, my brother when I played against my brother that's the only kind of shot he does and they're, they're quite OP, he he scores a lot of finesse shots but um, when I mean what I like about shooting I mean the fact that if you're off balance or whatever it'll curve to the opposite side of your foot like it does in real life which is which is quality, they've got that spot on and that's just that's awesome. As we're talking about shooting, just look at that goal. I don't even know how to score that goal just then that was that was a strange goal. But what I wanted to also talk about was I enjoy the defending quite a lot. It's I feel like I'm a little better at defending on this game than I was on FIFA thirteen for some reason. I don't know why. I feel like the defence I finally like as pacey and as decent as the um the attackers were on FIFA thirteen. If you if you attack red pace then he was off, you weren't catching him. Um I also like what they've done to the pace. If you've if the player's got pace then he he is able to stay away from the defender but which is obviously what he's meant to be. He's not meant to be able to just sprint past him if he's the walk or whatever. Because that's absolute BS. Um because if you're Theo Walker, he's, he, does he do that in real life? Not not really, he doesn't really, well he does use his pace, but he doesn't use it that much, he uses it for like short bursts, but pace on this is is uh, is pretty decent, and then I like, well, I like using strength, but I prefer using strength when you're a defender rather than when you're an attacker, I t don't tend to use the strength button at all to be honest when I'm an attacker I just hold LT down to move finer to do like a finer move so I don't kick the ball right in front of me because I, one thing that I hate on this game that I really dislike is you can't dribble like sprint dribble if you're in their half sprinting with the ball then they just boot it in front of them and I think players like Messi who should have insane ball control because he is one of the best players in the game is meant to obviously be decent at controlling the ball at his feet and having a ball close to his feet like he does in a real game not in the real game like he does in real life but in this game it I don't really like it seems unrealistic I think they need to tune it down a bit so hopefully bef while the before the game's actually fully released they maybe do some switches to that or whatever what I really do like is I like free kicks quite a lot um, I'm gonna try and I don't know if to bring a tutorial out or whether to just do a montage or something of um, free kicks that I can do I lo absolutely love doing the knuckleball I, 
I was messing around in the skill arena the other day, trying to do a proper decent knuckleball, and uh, the ball was actually full on swiveling in the air, which is just so realistic. It was absolutely quality. Hopefully, I'll be able to get a goal like that from a free kick or whatever soon, because that'd be absolutely sick. Um, and then, as I said, that I dislike running when dribbling. I do like just dribbling in. I dislike when you're sprinting and dribbling, but I do like when you just normally, um, when you just normally dribbling. I, I barely, I rarely ever sprint in, in the when I'm attacking, just because they keep the ball so close to their feet, they're less likely to be tackled like easily. So that's what I tend to do. Just playing this replay over and over again for some reason. But yeah, I really like the dribbling when it. Um, when you're not holding the sprint button down because I feel like I'm pretty decent at dribbling with the ball anyway so it's an advantage for me now getting on to the dislikes I've already said the strength I don't tend to use the strength button at all so I find myself thinking oh the only like what's the point in strength however in defending like Puyo just did then on the screen strength is quality but you don't need to use the strength button there I feel like the strength button is needed because obviously the player is not automatically going to push him off the ball but I don't know whether I don't know I, I don't tend to use it um, you can write in the comments below if you guys use it I don't really use it and I'm not going to I'm not saying it's pointless but I don't really I don't really see a need in using it I don't really well, not at the minute anyway, maybe an ultimate team because everyone we all know that head to head's a lot slower. So, this is head to head, this is a lot slower than ultimate team. Well, usually in FIFA's. So, we'll see where the actual full game comes out, whether um, it's going to be a lot different and whether I might need to use it or not. But here's a quick look at that. I just did a run just then with Messi tapped the sprint button, he booted the ball in he ahead of him, you'll see now, there but that was decent, it worked to my advantage and then the shot the outside of the boot was absolutely sick, I just, the shooting's just insane, I absolutely love the shooting what I don't like are the skills I find myself holding LT down anyway, when I'm doing the skills, I mean it doesn't really affect I don't think it affects when I do it anyway, but it doesn't really affect me when I when I click it anyway. But I don't I don't tend to do loads of skills. I do a few, but no major ones. I'm not a, I'm not a FIFA skiller, but I do do a few. I'm sure this is one big dislike for a lot of people, but sometimes it goes in their favour. I dislike. Sorry about that. The my speaker just went off. I was just saying, one big dislike is a finesse shot, but then if it's in your favour, then it's quite good, I guess. A finesse shot seems overpowered to me. My, against my brother, like I said, he always he was just scoring goal after goal after goal with a finesse shot, and I was just he was just saying how OP it was and how much it was like it in FIFA 12 or FIFA 11. We used to use finesse shot loads and they just always used to go in. But yeah, a lot like that. Another thing I do like, I really do like, is the pace of the defenders. But I don't know whether that's a disadvantage or whatever. Because you, you just saw there, Danny Alves, I know he's fast, but seriously. He just catches up with any defender. I'll try to show you what he was like. But it was just... it was. I found it quite... The, my headphones just shut off again they're playing up, they're terrible but I found the sprinting uh, when defending quite strange and won the last yeah. it's done it again one of the last things that I dislike is the bouncing, the ball bounce when you play a chip ball I feel like it bounces like it's in the rain I feel like it's not in the actual like ground so that's weird and I find myself never being able to get onto the end of the ball. But there you go, that's the full time whistle. If you have any likes and dislikes, or oh, you obviously will, 
make sure to leave a comment down below if you agree with some of my likes and dislikes make sure to say whatever you like or whatever you dislike that and yeah hope you enjoyed the video peace